Hi, I'm Phyllis from SouthernFrugal.com. Okay, we're having our smoothie this morning and uh, our little morning chat. Uh, this morning we're using the baby lettuce, baby spring mix, and uh, guess what I did? Let me show you. A whole container of 598 of baby spinach organic gone bad when you open it up it has an odor so it's dated the 23rd of August is the last day it was in the back of my refrigerator and I did not see it that's the first time I've done that but it made me sick yeah look at all that mm. I was so busy and enamored with the uh, kale the fresh kale I wasn't burying my greens and so it went bad, but anyway, so this morning uh, we're going to have some mango. Now this is great value mango, it's two cups, or a little over two cups, uh, that I was able to find in Walmart this time, so I was pretty happy with that. So we're having two, we'll just say two and a fourth cups of mango, two cups of the red grapes, which are very sweet, four dates, I'll just go ahead and put those in. And this morning I'm just using one orange. Now these are regular navel oranges, but they don't have any seeds in them. So I'm going to go ahead and put the grapes in. And I'm just going to use one banana this morning. I went to the store yesterday morning because I had to go shopping anyway. And the reason I did is that the uh, garbage disposal blew up. <laughs> it did. I was making, uh, was peeling apples, and we like to have apples, and then those little homemade almond cookies, crumble those up on top there. It's really delicious. It's really good with any kind of fruit like that. Just crumble the cookies up on top. And peeling the apples, put them in the garbage disposal, because we're really not uh, composting anymore because we don't want to get the compost bin any more full than it already is and uh, turn the water on full blast turn the garbage disposal on just like I always do and it blew the pipe out the little connection and so when I opened the cabinet door to see what was wrong it blew it all over me all the way up to here I had apple peelings all in little itty bitty pieces all over me but anyway we're gonna um, I went ahead yesterday while I was shopping and went ahead and bought a garbage disposal so uh, if all goes well I'll let y'all uh, I'll just film it when I'm taking the old one out and putting the new one in now the one that we uh, the one that went bad was 10 years old and it was uh, three-fourths um, what do you call it, three-fourths horsepower. And I remember when I got it, uh, my plumber friend at Lowe's told me he didn't think I needed a three-fourths horsepower. But I said, oh, I think I want the most powerful one. So I got it. Well, I got a taste yesterday of how powerful it is. It had blown a little, I think you call it gasket, and blew the little uh, drainage tube out. And, that's, and because of the way it was spinning, when I opened the cabinet door, it blew it all over me, rather than in the cabinet, which was good, right? Except it was all over the floor and all over, I had to literally go take a bath. It was bad. But uh, anyway, we're going to get that problem solved first thing this morning. All right, so the banana I'm using, because I got bananas yesterday, is a fresh banana. Just one, because those little baby greens you know, don't have much of a taste really when you put all the other stuff in them. All right, so I'm going to dump the two cups of mangoes in, and they are still frozen, and they did come from Peru, and I've just kind of gotten over my don't want to have stuff from foreign countries because it's almost impossible. Now, the other thing we're going to do, to me, mangoes taste like peaches that are spicy. That's what they taste like to me. So this morning, I'm going to use three little slices of fresh ginger, 
and get it in here and we'll put all three slices in and these were slices from the other day uh, when we made that meal so anyway I'm looking for the juice let me turn this down so y'all can see there we go we'll move in closer there right there all right let's see if we can get some of this let me see if I can turn it so y'all can see I'm looking for the juice can y'all see that dripping out Oop. I'll go ahead and put some of the actual ginger in there too but what I was mainly looking for is that ginger juice so we'll put some in there it's gonna be interesting to see what this tastes like and of course uh, ginger is very good for you particularly if you have any kind of stomach ailments let's see if we can get more of that out of there yeah this little thing works great you know this little garlic press see I'm gonna scrape that off too All right, that's a lot of ginger in there, but I'm hoping it's going to taste really good. All right, I've got to get my water, and I'm going to go ahead and grind this up. No peanut butter this morning because I want to be able to taste those mango. All right, we'll be back. All right, this is all ground up. I did taste of it, y'all. It's delicious. There's what it looks like. And that dark co color is coming from the... Uh, the lettuce. Oh. All right, we're ready. It's pretty thick this morning. Way beyond delicious. Way, way beyond. It is super good. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. I can definitely taste the mango. Now, if I had put peanut butter and uh, cream of wheat and oatmeal in this, even the almond butter, I probably wouldn't have been able to taste the mango, but this is quite delicious. But because it doesn't have all that other stuff in it, we're probably gonna be hungry pretty soon today. We won't be able to go till three o'clock in the afternoon, I'm sure. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and get some work clothes on. And uh, after we have devotions, I'm going to get started on installing that uh, garbage disposal. This is not something I'm thrilled about, but it has to be done. All right, so we'll see y'all maybe a little later on. Bye for now. Okay, we're back because I forgot to show y'all the kale. I am so delighted with this. Now, when I get it home, I wash it real good and put it in. I actually use the filtered water, put it in a big pot and let it soak up and see it. Can y'all hear that? It stays really super crispy. Yeah, I had to get more of it, y'all. It is so, so good. All right, for sure, we'll see you next time.